Royal snub. Guest who gave Meghan's number to Harry did not attend wedding evening party. Violet von Wistenholtz, the woman said to be responsible for giving Meghan Markle's number to Prince Harry and suggested they meet, did not attend the evening party of the couple's royal wedding. The reported matchmaker did attend the wedding and afternoon reception, but her absence was distinctly noticeable from the evening frivolities at Frogmore House. It appears she could have made separate plans for the evening. Ms. Wistenholtz was seen at the wedding of Ed Watson, an old friend of the Duke of Sussex, and Cara Louise Pratt, after taking part in the royal engagement. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were set up on a blind date towards the start of July in 2016. The smitten couple's first television interview detailed a mutual friend was responsible for their blossoming romance. Prince Harry said, We were introduced actually by a mutual friend. It was definitely a setup. It was a blind date. However, at the time the couple attempted to protect the secrecy of their matchmaker. The Duke noted, We were introduced by a secret friend, who we will protect her privacy. Royal Cupid Violet, 33, has been a trusted childhood friend of the Duke of Sussex for years. The fashion PR was once reportedly romantically linked to singer James Blunt, who also attended the wedding. Violet's father, Baron Piers von Wistenholtz, is a former Olympic skier and a friend of Prince Charles. Ms. Wistenholtz met Meghan Markle while working as a press relations director for Ralph Lauren. She is understood to have soon become the mediator between the pair and responsible for setting up their first date that ultimately turned into a royal romance. A source told E. News Prince Harry was having a really hard time finding anyone before he met Meghan. They commented, Harry was having a really hard time finding anyone. It's hard enough finding someone new to date. He can hardly go on Tinder or a dating app like normal people, but to meet someone that you actually connect with, that was proving to be almost impossible. It was something he had confided in his closest friends about. He was ready to meet someone, but it was so hard to actually find the right person. Meghan had been a part of the London social scene for a while and had slotted into the high society set really easily. Prince Harry confided in Ms. Wistenholtz who claimed she could have the perfect girl in mind, the source added. They went on and so when Harry told Violet he was having trouble finding someone, Violet said she might just have the perfect girl for him.